beautiful people welcome back to another vlog today i am starting a vlog on my way to work because last week i did not put up a vlog because um i didn't really have anything to do <laughs> so i said you know what let me start to film some footage before so I can build on it and I will have a vlog to post for you all this week all right I didn't feel too good about not posting last week so we gotta get it together this week I am here by the tire shop um, I noticed that my tire looks just a little like it needs air and I don't know how to put air in my tire I wanted to come and make sure that nothing isn't causing the tire to go down one and also for the guy to put air for me <laughs> yeah so i am here waiting for the guy to show up uh, he said that they open at eight it's now 806 where's the time where's um the time keeping up in here so I'm just here talking to you lovely people until the guy shows up let me give you a little update on driving so I am still a little nervous when I drive I'm not going to, to lie I'm not like confident but I am better than where I used to be a lot better one thing that I would like to do is venture to different places you know and that is how you really build your confidence you know when you go to different places and you know you get that experience because when I went to Trin City Mall I I felt really confident that you know I should be able I would be able to basically go I'm thinking about what I'm going to say and again a little nervous ah, but somebody being in a vehicle with me really 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 helps okay okay is the rain coming down here I want to show you all these tire you know but I just don't want to come out of the vehicle to broadcast that I'm person who's in a vehicle because uh, where is this guy it's 808 now trainees and their time mm -mm -mm -mm. and I was here like maybe quarter to eight not like about 10 to eight but oh gosh boy oh gosh oh gosh oh gosh How long do I have to wait here for this guy? Did he mean 10 o'clock? Sorry, 8 o'clock in some other part of the world and he actually come at 9 o'clock? I Ugh! come on! <laughs> hmm. Like, I don't feel comfortable just sitting down here in this lonely looking space. <sighs> just want to get myself, my stuff done and get out of here. Okay? Okay. Okay. Alright guys, so update. The guy came like almost half past eight. Um, my tires were um, aired up. And... Um, well, he told me I, I, I basically have to pressure my tires on a monthly basis. So they were, all of them needed pressure basically. So thank goodness that I did go to check it out. But homeboy charged me $20 for air. $20 for air. So 
I guess I have to find a new tire spot because they seem like they take advantage of females. So no, hell no. Like me and them, but I leave you there to do what you what you, what you want to do. So I see what you rather do. So mm -mm. I ain't going back there. Um. So I know what I'm supposed to do now. So I'll go to the gas station and air up my tires when it is on a monthly basis, as he suggested. But I will not be going back to that tire shop. Sorry. No. 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 Anyways, I'm at work now, so I'm off. And I'll see you all when I grab back up the camera. Good morning guys. So it's the next day and I am trying to quickly leave home to go to the gym. So no, I'm not starting to gym now or anything like that. I'm just going to check out this new gym that opened in Eastgate Small. Um, so I've been wanting to have like a nice bougie kind of, you know, a nice clean, nice vibe gym in the east and i saw that it opened somewhere so i'm going to check it out and if i like the vibe or whatnot i may join later on this year but not early this, early on this year is too much too much so maybe later on in the year so i am heading there now so let me just show you what i'm wearing no i am um, i don't really own gym clothes like that because I don't go to the gym, but let me show you what I'm wearing. All right, this quick little fit. This is it. This is it. Let's go get fit. <laughs> All right, guys. So we buy the gym. We are by the gym. Well, me and Jenny. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to go to spin class. All right. Yes. We late. So. We catch you on the inside so let me just tell you when you're coming into east gates instead of going straight you're going right is right yeah yeah you're going right and if you're unsure just ask the security um at the entrance where you're supposed to go upstairs so we're going up the stairs <laughs> Wait, what we had to do? Just to register. All right, guys, you're going to register. BRB. Guys, so we finish registering and it's one time it's one time you're supposed to register in. Yeah. only one time you're registering and then you just come and well if you're doing like paid sessions it will be every time you had a pay and it's 24 hours that the payment lasts for so we need for spend so we're getting in there let's go So we 
rush up to spin class we can I'm getting on bad in there. Um I doubt we can film while they are um, doing it, but <laughs> we rush on all here. No that is aerobics. That is aerobics. Bathroom, very nice, very nice, nice lighted mirror. What you say? Like a nice toilet set over there, and then a bench you could change, lockers there. Love it. Nice. There's me. Hey, hey. Goal is abs. Nothing else. Abs. Abs. Nothing else, nothing else, nothing else. <laughs> when I thought I'd done, there is a shower. A nice little shower area, right? You can take a nice little bath and thing. Right? There's another one too. So there's not just one, there are two bathrooms. So you can bathe your dirty skin. Right, what is here? This is a changing room. This, this is a changing room here, I guess. A few moments later. Back at home, guys. And yes, my nose is stuffy. Um, but yes, I just wanted to tell you about my little gym experience. Um, while I tell you this, let me snack on my um, hot cross bun that I got from Food Hall. Uh, let me show you. Yes, that's them there. Let me just grab one. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Very fruity. Very nice. Um mm. Mm -hmm. so let me tell you my gym experience. So we were supposed to do spin, but we we got in a little late-ish. But when we got there, the gym instructor he came. While we were there, so I wouldn't say we were like that late. 
but when we got upstairs because the spent glass was upstairs um they told us that it was it only had space for one more person and of course we saw it was two of us so we didn't want to go i do think that the spin room is a bit small because it wasn't like a lot a lot of people who were there and it was basically already full with just one more space available so we opted to do a rubik's instead which was right next to the spin class and that was really good as you saw you know I, I took a clip of it it was really good so basically we just paid for the pass which was 50 dollars and we could have done anything that we wanted to we could have used the equipment and whatnot but we decided to just try out our class but i love all of the different equipment that they have very modern very you know new and there was someone cleaning down the equipment i saw that i don't know if like they do like keep they have like a person who keeps cleaning the equipment or if i was just there at the time that she was assigned to clean i don't know but i did see that but yeah the registration process was pretty seamless you know you just get there you had to register on your phone you had wi-fi if you don't have data on your logo and then you put plug in your information you take a selfie or upload an image and yeah that was basically it the day passes for 24 hours so we went for nine o'clock and she told us that we had until nine o'clock tomorrow um we could have come back up until nine o'clock tomorrow if we wished i would like to go and uh, use the machines and stuff because it looks really nice i i must say it makes me feel to get fit it makes me feel to work out if you know what i'm saying <laughs> All right, so I really don't have anything else planned to do today. Um, I have to cook. Uh, so I may show you guys that. What else? Uh, that's mainly what I have to do. I have to cook and um, just regular chores, weekend chores today. To wash my hair stuff like that so i don't know if you all want to see that or not um but that is what i will be doing hi guys so it's the next day again so i am here getting ready i'm bit in a rush what's new so i'm heading to la Vigi. i've always wanted to go to la Vigi and today is the day like i am a person i love god's creation nature love it like some people they, they like buildings and architecture and stuff like that for me i love nature god's creation so just how la Vigi has that beautiful view of nature i'm so excited to go so um let me just show you my fit quickly and um i'm basically ready i just need to um grab some stuff to put in my purse and i'll be on my way so this is the fit right i wear this top a lot because <laughs> i love it a lot right from sheen this skirt was from bang bang yeah it's a long skirt with a slit in the back a high slit in the back and you yeah, let's go to la vici <laughs>
Okay, so plans change from going to La Fiji. Um, the terrain was a bit too steep for the vehicle, so we are now going to Maraca. So we see you at the beach. amazing <laughs> all right so basically i told you all i was going to the paramen um la Vici lookout but the vehicle couldn't go up that those mountains oh my gosh those mountains are so steep so um the other plan was to go to maracas beach but then plan three plan c plan three was to go to Shagaramas and that was really nice like I never really went down to Shagaramas and dine at any of the um, places down there but I think I may make it a thing because of the waterfront setting and whatnot so I'm gonna buy rock back which they more they more like sell finger foods so um, I had like a shrimp burger, shrimp burger with fries, which was very delicious, right? And I had some pina coladas, that were, they were okay, they were right. You know, you all know I'm a pina colada connoisseur, so I know the creme de la creme of pina colada and it was okay. I won't say it was terrible or bad or anything like that, it was, it was okay so yes so now i have to um go and do my meal prep as i told you i can't remember when that i had to do that so i finished cleaning i did that this morning um what else did i have to do the only thing i have to do is my meal prep now so i'm going to change and go get into my meal prep so i'm set for work the work week so yes I had a really really great weekend this weekend yeah so 
I guess I'll see you all in the next vlog. Until the next one, guys. Love, love, love you all. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Okay. I know it's been a little while, but I gotta let them know, yeah, gotta let them know. if you ever been down.